Yo, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Sofa here. Welcome back to a brand new YouTube video. Now, today's video, I'm going to show you guys the best new updated macro inside of Fish. Now, before you get to the video, make sure you like and subscribe as well. Really appreciate it. And it does help with the channel a lot. Yeah, let's not waste no more time and get directly into this macro. Let's go. All right, y'all. So basically, in order for this whole macro to end up working, y'all going to end up wanting to get this little thing called auto hotkey. As y'all can see, I'm going to have the link in the description. But basically, this is the safe way for your macros to end up working. And I'm going to go ahead and just pull up the receipts right quick. As you can see, this is the official Discord for Fish. And basically, they do even recommend this hotkey right here as y'all can see they recommend auto hotkey this is definitely the best to end up having y'all scripts work so go ahead and click the link in the description and end up going to this website y'all gonna end up wanting to go over here and download this down right here now y'all gonna want to download the one on the right which says download 1.1 deprecated all right now i have had people download 2.0 but the first point this one right here is the one that works better so go ahead go over here and download this john now i already have it uh downloaded and set up pretty much but basically you just gonna end up wanting to download it and click it through and it's gonna end up setting up on your computer it's really really easy and really simple so yeah go ahead and do that right quick and let's move on to the next part all right you guys so at this point what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna end up going in the link in the description again and completing this little record source inside of the uh description and once you do end up completing this it's gonna end up taking you to this download for the fish macro as y'all can see right here and basically y'all gonna want to go right here and end up downloading this macro that's gonna end up it might give you a little pop-up or something you could close out of that or it'll end up closing automatically but it's gonna end up downloading the macro right here as y'all can see i already have the macro installed so that's why it has a one right here but yeah as y'all can see i ended up downloading it right here and i'm gonna end up showing you how it ended up working all right y'all so at this point you should have ended up downloading auto hotkey and the macro and basically once you end up downloading those two things what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna adjust a couple of settings so this whole thing can end up working now the first and most important thing y'all gonna end up needing to do is take all the white off of your character okay so if your character has like white hair or even white skin sometimes i don't think it ends up working but yeah, just take all the white off of your character. Otherwise, it ain't gonna work. The second thing is you, can, you cannot stand on anything white. So as you can see, this pillow right here is like a little white. You cannot stand on it. Otherwise, the macros gonna end up breaking. Look, that's just how it is. I don't I don't know the logic into it. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. And yeah, the third thing y'all gonna end up wanting to uh, unfull screen y'all stuff. So your game probably gonna end up looking like this. Just go ahead and unfull screen that right quick. As you can see, you are gonna want to have your stuff looking like this. And lastly, but not least, and you know this is probably a lot of stuff. But what you're gonna want to do is go over to your settings. You're gonna scroll all the way down and end up turning your UI navigation on. All right. So go ahead and turn this on. As you can see, the default thing for it should end up being the backslash. As you can see, use the backslash key to end up entering or exiting the UI navigation mode. This doesn't really matter, but yeah, just make sure you end up having this on, all right? Turn that on. It's very important. Now, once you do end up having all them things follow up, what you're going to want to do is you're going to end up going over to your folder, which ends up having the macro installed. So as you can see, I have it in my Boys Who Cry folder. You're going to end up going ahead and double clicking this. What this is going to end up doing is ending up enabling the macro, as y'all can see. As you can see, it's right here. And yeah, let's end up getting into how the macro ends up working. All right, y'all. So just to explain how this macro ends up working, basically, you're going to end up having three buttons. There's going to be P to end up starting the macro up, O to reload the macro or basically reset it, and M to exit. So as you can see, let's go ahead and test it out. What you're going to want to do is go over to a big body of water or you could go over to the pond. It doesn't really matter. But I'm going over to this big body of water, the little ocean. And what you're going to want to do is face four and put on your best ride. As y'all can see, I am using the no life ride. You can use the best ride. You can really use any ride, but just use the ride that's the best in y'all inventory it doesn't really matter uh it works for literally every rod i think except a couple but yeah it should work for the good majority of rods but basically i'm gonna end up using the no life rod and basically what you're gonna do is hit p and this is gonna end up basically adjusting all y'all settings right here as y'all can see now what it's gonna end up doing it's gonna end up cast the rod as y'all can see and it's gonna end up automatically shaking all right so boom 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 and it's gonna end up shaking and it's gonna end up doing the whole mini game right here as y'all can see completely safe completely free as y'all can see we don't have to do nothing like literally i, I don't even have my hands on the keyboard i ain't gonna lie to y'all i don't have my hands on the keyboard the whole thing is doing this i'm in a public server right now so it don't matter if you're in a public or private i've seen people talking about that but yeah it doesn't really matter what, what y'all plan in and basically as y'all can see it's gonna end up working for me now when we feel like we're done with this macro we're gonna end up doing is pressing o and that's gonna end up loading the macro and as y'all can see as y'all can see like that it just ended up working really easy really simple now another little tip that i would recommend with for y'all to end up doing this uh thing which y'all gonna want to do is equip the rapid catches as y'all can end up seeing so go over there to the little bake crates and end up equipping the rapid catches now especially if you like trying to fish real quick with your macro and like catch as much maximize the amount of fish output y'all gonna end up doing equip these macro uh these rapid catches and as y'all can see if i do end up enabling my stuff again as y'all can see it's gonna basically do it instantly and it's gonna be really 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 fast all right so as y'all can see as soon as i throw my fish fish rod in there as i see boom like that it's gonna be this is gonna be the fastest way you can end up catching fishes right here and especially like for upcoming events and stuff or even the event that's going on right now at the time of this recording it's gonna be best for catching as many fish as y'all can all right as i can see again i'm gonna go ahead and do this right here once again it's gonna 
gonna end up doing that instantly. Boom. I mean, it doesn't really matter what you're doing because at the end of the day, you're using a macro. But yeah, rapid catches is definitely gonna be the best. And we done. We just go ahead, put on O, and M is just gonna end up closing this whole macro thing down. And yeah. All right, you guys. So now I'm gonna end up showing you the best money and XP areas you can end up going with this macro. And I have tested pretty much every single island and every single area y'all can end up going to. And as y'all can see, I'm gonna end up showing y'all the best XP and money levels to end up hitting max level. As y'all can see, I'm max level and getting as much money as y'all can see. As y'all can see, I have 16 million, which is probably a lot more than a lot of people watching this have, not to flex or anything. But y'all might have more, y'all might have less. But this is just for everybody to end up watching in. Where y'all can end up going to get as much money and XP as y'all can overnight. So the first place we're gonna end up going over to is Forsaken. As y'all can see, use y'all GPS or whatever and just ride over here to Forsaken Shores. It'll be like pinged in the air. Basically, what you're going to end up wanting to do is going over here to Forsaken Shores. Now, once you are here, you're going to end up going inside of this pond and using your macro. Now, this is going to be the best part for getting goldfish, all right? Now, goldfish are going to give you a ton of XP. So, if this dude could move out of my way, he keep following me. But you're going to end up going over here. And this is going to be the best part for XP. So, what you're going to end up wanting to do, stop following me. Goodness gracious. You're going to end up going over here. And, um, yeah. So, I'm going to move past this dude. It's going to be the best part. And I think I do still have my... uh. My, my rapid catch is enabled as well, so we can end up going over here. We're probably not going to catch nothing good, but yeah, as y'all can see, you're going to end up wanting to go over here, and this is going to be the best part for this SP right here. So yeah, as y'all can see, I'm going to catch something. It was a little, a little long, but I'm going to go ahead and exit that out. And yeah, this is going to be the best part for XP. So I'm going to end up showing y'all what the best thing for money is. All right, you guys. Now, what you're going to end up wanting to do for this last part is you're going to end up heading over here to the Ancient Isles. As y'all can end up seeing, I'm over here, and this is basically going to be the best spot for money. As y'all can see, I just had 16 mil, but I just spent some on box. But right now I have 15.5 mil as y'all can end up seeing now What you're gonna want to do is you're gonna end up coming over here and you're gonna want to go over here by this waterfall Now what you want to do is equip your best rod as y'all can see I have the no life rod on right here But you can end up equipping your best rod and equip some decent bait now You're gonna end up getting a good enchant so for me I have abysmal line what you're gonna want to do is end up getting as close as you can to the uh The edge of the waterfall and what you're gonna want to do is end up enabling y'all macro right here Now this is gonna be where you're gonna get all this money at so let's go ahead Let's enable our macro right quick so as you can see it's gonna end up scrolling in and stuff as y'all can see this is just gonna uh adjusting the stuff and you know what i'm saying and as i can see boom we just ended up ca catching the fish right there and this is where we're gonna be getting all the big fishes at this is gonna be where we get the giant uh octopuses and stuff and this is basically where you see everybody pretty much macro in that i uh, like i ain't gonna lie this is probably the best spot if you're not necessarily going specifically for xp so yeah i recommend going here once you get a decent rod and this is definitely gonna be one of those spots that you're gonna be at for a while catching all the fish as you can end up seeing this is basically light work i'm not i don't have my hands on the keyboard another thing and this is just raw footage i haven't really showed a lot of raw footage in this video but yeah this is basically where you're gonna end up being at so yeah all right guys and that's gonna end up wrapping up the whole entire video i hope you guys did end up enjoying if you guys do have any questions comments or concerns please leave them in the comment section down below but yeah it's your boys over here i hope you guys did end up enjoying the video and yeah bye